I recently published a video on how you can track changes on your Excel spreadsheet so that you know what changes and when it was made. However, someone had requested if I can also include field name on my log sheet here. So to start off with, I'm going to add a new column called field name on the very last column here. And then to edit the VBA, you're going to right click on the tab and open a VBA code. I have another video dedicated to explaining how this VBA actually works. If you need this link, please leave a request on the comment section. To populate the field name column on the log sheet, add the additional line of code at this location, targeting column 6, and invoke the get header title function with the argument of target. Next, we'll define the get header title function, taking argument of target as range. This function is essentially going to return the very first row of that column which the user is editing in the dataset, also known as field name. Control S to save and then close your VBA editor. Test by modifying the title, first name and employee ID. Go to the log sheet to observe all the changes that were logged, including the field name. 